Oh, so, I got really exciting news. My next adventure is gonna be with this bad boy. And yeah, I'm going bikepacking. I'm so excited about that, you can't believe it. Like, traveling with a bicycle, of course, like, traveling with a bicycle has like so much advantages and also, of course, challenges, but I'm really looking forward to finally <laughs> traveling, to finally be traveling with a bike and yeah. So, this is actually a pretty old mountain bike. I got it for my birthday, I think, when I was 10 or something, so it's about 10 years old. And yeah, it it has its scars, but but I think it's still a pretty decent bike, and it will do the job. And so you might not be familiar with bike packing. So bike packing is basically traveling with a bicycle, and then normal people would choose like a normal bicycle where you can put on these huge like saddlebags like in the front and in the back but the difference between bike packing and just traveling with a normal bike is that you want to have a mountain bike and as you can see mountain bikes don't have like the best setup to to attach a lot of storage to it which you need when you are traveling with a bicycle because you don't want to have a big backpack when you are bikepacking because your ass will hurt anyway from sitting all day on the bike and when you put additionally some weight on your shoulders so yeah it will get even worse so that's for that and so the challenge is in bikepacking with a mountain bike how to store your stuff because the goal is as i said because of course the goal is to put as much as storage onto your bike and i'm over the next couple of days trying to build myself like custom storage bags for the bike and you will see all of that in the next video i didn't even i didn't even So I didn't even talk about where I was, where I would go. So, since I live in South Germany, I'm really close to Switzerland. Like, it's about 100 kilometers. So it's pretty close, and Switzerland is like beautiful, like absolutely beautiful, no doubt. So I really want, I really wanted to to travel Switzerland for a long time, and now I'm finally gonna do it with a bicycle which is, I guess, kind of a good idea and kind of a bad idea at the same time because, you know, traveling with a bike is cheap and awesome but also Switzerland has a lot of mountains like, there are, there's nothing but mountains in Switzerland and lakes so, yeah, I'm gonna be, I think each day I'm traveling in Switzerland will be insane and the thing is, Switzerland is expensive. It's like, like not Europe kind of expensive, it's expensive, expensive. It's like food in Europe has a certain price in most countries and in Switzerland it's double. And basically everything is double in Switzerland, it's crazy. So, I don't know, so, so I will be traveling with a tent and wild camping and hopefully I'm able to wild camp most of the time and I'm also trying to couch surf in the big cities because I also want to visit some of them so yeah I think it's gonna be an awesome adventure and it's definitely something also something new for me because I never traveled with a bike before but I'm really excited to do it and yeah and <laughs> We'll see if I'm, and after the journey, we will see if I'm still that, 
if I'm still that excited about traveling with a bike. <laughs>